Hello YouTube, welcome, welcome to Shorup's tutorial. Um, today we're going to learn about tally. Um, our subject is today. Today we're going to learn how to create stock group in tally, how to create stop subgroup in tally, and how to create categories in tally, and the last how to create stock items in tally suppose we're going to start electronic business so here you go in electronics uh, we have one group in electronics and in that group we will have subgroups like mobile and tv in that mobile and tv we're going to have some another subgroups is uh, samsung or iphone i right here in tv samsung and lg and we'll have some category suppose mobile with the 5 inches display and uh, with the 4.5 inches display and uh, TVs with the 30 inches and 35 inches so let's start here you are uh, we have to first of all we have to go to the account inventory in account inventory you have to create go to the account stock groups then just go to the create in create uh, this uh, screen will be pop up in front of you that is that will be asked for this group suppose we're going to uh, our group will be electronics so type electronics over there and it will be our primary groups so it will ask you can quantities of items be added we're going to say yes so now uh, in that electronics group we're going to have some subgroups like uh, mobile now here you can see you can see in the under we're going to uh, we're going to give electronics because mobile is under electronics subgroup because it's a it's a subgroup so we're going to give the mobile under electronics accept it like this enter and enter the another subgroup it is called tv we're going to have mobile and tv we're going to business mobile and tv so here you can see tv will be also in the subgroup of electronics so we're going to select electronics from here and press enter and uh, it will be can uh, can quantities of items be added it will be just remain uh, it is selected as yes and we're going to press enter and accept it like this and now we already have the subgroups of tv and mobile in that tv and mobile we're going to have another subgroup it is uh, there are some other uh, some brands of tvs like samsung and LG and in the mobile there's Samsung and iPhone so let's start with the mobile we have some uh, mobile in the name of Samsung Samsung mobile we just going to create uh, I'm going to give Samsung mobile but here now you have to select in mobile because you're going to give the mobile enter enter samsung mobile then iphone like this iphone mobile i'm mentioning mobile because uh, it should be clear to you that uh, samsung can be tv or mobile that's why i'm mentioning samsung mobile now i'm mentioning iphone mobile it will go under mobile like this now uh, uh if you want to check what you can create just go you just press escape escape from your button or just here quit so if you want to check what you created you can check over here display if you go to the display you can see electronics electronic groups and iphone under mobile then samsung mobile under mobile so we're going to create another some another subgroups like we already create mobile now Samsung 
TV. Samsung TV, it will be under the subgroup of Samsung, is under subgroup of TV. LG TV, it will be under the subgroup of, here you can say TV, I select TV over here and accept all this. Now we already created the all groups and subgroups in the display. Go to the display and you can see what are the groups and subgroups you have created. Samsung TV, Samsung Mobile, LG TV, uh, iPhone Mobile. Like this. If you want to check Samsung TV, it is created on the TV. If you want to check anything or you, you can alter this thing. Suppose you have done any mistakes, you can uh, alter from there. Suppose if I uh, you have uh, I have done any mistakes in iPhone mobile. Suppose here, so I can change here. I can change here. Change and again I can accept and uh, alter. I mean to say you can edit these things, these groups. So here you are. Uh, just uh, I'm just skipping, skipping on that, and I'm just come in the menu of inventory info again here uh, the category is already created uh, already shown but if it is not shown over there you have to go to the f12 i'm showing you again you have to go to the f12 uh, configuration sorry you have to go to the features come to the inventory feature here you can see in the storage classification uh, in storage and classification you can see maintain stock categories here if there is no you have to give just yes yes right yes and you can accept this one uh, pressing alter a it is safe then it will be shown sorry inventory info then uh, stock categories will be shown over there now we know that uh, our stock categories will be in uh, let's go to the stock categories and we're going to create some uh, stock categories because uh, we know that uh, our Samsung mobile will be in uh, our mobiles actually our mobiles in five inch five inch uh, mobile so all the all the thing all the categories will be in primary mode so we're not going to do anything else uh, and 4.5 inch mobiles and another category in our TV we know that it's 30 inch uh, TVs it will, all categories will be in primary mode under the primary so another is 35 inch TV sorry here yeah, I have done, I think I have done one mistake that, uh, so, in the display you can see in the 30 inch, 30 inch I did not give TV over there. So what I have to do, how can I change that one, press escape, in pressing escape, going to this menu, stock category menu, then I am going to the alter, enter, just I am going to change this 30 inch, 30 inch I have to give TV over there that's it then I have to enter enter and accept this one so we already created some categories and groups then we can check over here stock groups we can uh, check in the display some categories we have created electronics under electronics we created mobile and TV and under mobile and TV we created in under mobile we created iPhone mobile Samsung mobile and under TV we created LG TV and Samsung TV so now we're going to straight away we're going to create some items for this one I have to just press escape and here you can see in inventory info menu we can see a stock items just I'm going over there and pressing enter before going over there we have to create another thing unit of measures because unit of measures is needed sometimes we sell some things in cage, uh, in kilos kilograms or sometimes in pieces sometimes in meters so here all the items we're going to sell in 
pieces that's why we have to create units of measure units of measure also here i am entering in the units of units and then create i am entering in the create so it's going to be simple as a as that simple and then uh, symbol will be pieces pcs it will be pieces formal name yeah uh, you can escape of p i c e s or whatever it is just uh, you can escape from there and enter enter and enter to accept this one so i am going back with the escape and at the another escape now i am ready to create the stock items so i am uh, going in the stock items i am pressing enter in the stock items then i am going to create pressing enter create now i am going to make samsung s5 samsung i am just typing samsung s first of all i am going to s4 i enter if you have any allies or item code or whatever it is you can give over there and i am not giving i am just leaving it, it and empty i am pressing another enter so it is going to ask you uh, under which category or under which group you going to give list of group you can see is showing so i am going to give it in the samsung mobile category because samsung s4 uh here uh, sorry i have to write down center uh, samsung s4 mobile you can write or yeah other you can leave it like that samsung s4 mobile for your samsung s4 mobile uh, for your convenient or uh, for your um, uh, to do the things easy uh, samsung s4 mobile so i in the under the group i am just selecting over here samsung mobile under the group then category sitting asking which category it is uh, it's a 5 inch mobile so i'm selecting over here list of category will be shown i'm selecting 5 inch mobile over there then uh, units it is asking for units uh, i'm just units i will going to pieces because we're going to sell it in the pieces just leave it as it is and enter 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 and enter or y to accept i'm just pressing enter to accept our item is created one item is created another item is uh, iphone uh, you can create many items uh, or another item you can samsung samsung s3 or uh, samsung dos Samsung dos enter enter uh it is under the Samsung mobile category uh, uh, group and it will be the category 4.5 inch mobile pieces just as it is and uh, i'm going to press enter and enter in another mobile i can create is iphone iPhone 5 iPhone 5 mobile iPhone 5 under the categories of uh, iPhone mobile then it is also 5 inch mobile and i am going to select pieces this is how you can create uh, items and uh, if i show tv smart tv samsung smart tv now uh, it will be the different group because it's samsung tv it will be under the different group uh, and also under the different category it's a 30 inch tv suppose samsung tv is 30 inch and we're going to sell in pieces that's why i'm going to select pieces from there and leave as it is as enter 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 and enter to accept this one this is how and uh, if you want to see what are the items you created just uh, from the create go to the escape 
skip two times and then display under the display you can see these are the items you have created if you enter in the items and uh, you can see the details of the items uh, under and which under under which group under which category under which units you have created the items and if you want to uh, say want to escape or escape just go back and if you want to edit any items so just you have to go to the alter and select which items you're going to edit so suppose I'm going to edit this Samsung dos I'm just to give uh, something to mobile you can press enter enter or you can press or uh, control F to save this one this is how viewers and uh, TVS thank you for watching this is how we're going to create actually we have create uh, four things we have done four things group subgroups uh, we have created groups sorry uh, in inventory infos we have created groups subgroups categories uh, stock items and uh, units of measurement uh, so that's it thank you for watching this video if you like this one don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you very much